If you are under the age of 18, the content of this video is not intended for you. Please stop watching now. Hey YouTube, it's Audrey and I wanted to come in kind of quickly. I didn't even set up the camera um, for um, taking the video this time, but I just wanted to be pretty quick and share with you a card that I made and then how I finished up one of the card fronts that I made with the metallic ink on the black paper last week on my Work With It Wednesday uh series so if you haven't seen that work with it wednesday episode from last week the last wednesday in april then head on over and check it out so i use this diamond press set and this is a slimline die set and it has this insert and then it also has this outer scalloped edge which you can see there so i use that I used one of the sentiment um, dies sets, or uh, one of the sentiment pieces out of this Alta New set. From this My Creative Time stamp set, I use the Happy, the Mothers, and the Day. From this My Creative Time set, I use this Mother's Day Blessings right here. And then from these Crafters Companion sets, I used a couple of the sentiments. This one was from the Special Someone set, and this one was from the It's the Thought That Counts set. So I needed a quick Mother's Day card. I needed a um, couple of them, actually, but this one is the one that I made with the Diamond Press set. And this is very easy because it's basically a cover plate. And then I stamped the Happy Mother's Day with that My Creative Time set and used that all to new strip die. And basically on the inside, I used one of the Crafters Companion stamps. So very quick, very easy. I wanted to do... Um, some different color um, than what traditional Mother's Day cards would be. So I went with the navy and the yellow. And then this is how I finished up that rose card that I made the card front last week using the metallic inks on black cardstock and an embossing folder stencil set. So I mounted it on a green card base. I added the Mother's Day Blessing and that little tag shape was a mini tag shape from my creative time also. I have put that one back up. So then on the inside, I double matted it and used one of the my creative time Um not my creative time oh crafters companion i'm sorry it's late one of the crafters companion stamps so i finished this one and i made this one and i kept them flat so i could put them in the mail to people so um just wanted to come in and share that with you guys so thanks so much for watching and you guys have a great and a very blessed day Bye bye